How are you doing? This is Professor Farrow over at Farrow Academy. I'm going to show you guys just the setup of a key lock from side control that I like to do, especially if you're going against stronger opponents. All right. So Josh is going to be on his back here. Now just, I get the basic side control and he should have his, exactly, he has his elbows in. Okay, if his arms are flailing out, that's when I'm going to start attacking the key lock. I'm going to get underneath, smash. So he's doing a good job. He's keeping a frame. So what I like to do here, I got to trap trap this arm down. So I can't, I can't just take my left hand, come up like this and trap his arm and try to pin him down. Okay. A lot of, a lot of bad technique there. So what I, I figured out over the years is just, I have to, you know, obviously I got to use my whole body, especially if I'm going against stronger people in this position. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to have the control of my left hand around his head. I'm going to kind of switch my hips to my right, but I'm going to stay heavy and I'm going to keep blocking his hip. Okay. I, I can't be loose with this. I can't be leaning over. Okay, I'm gonna be right in the center here. My chest is right on top of him. Now, what I like to do to get break this grip, I kind of come up a little bit as I pull with my right, so to kind of keep him down. I kind of snake my left arm in and I cup. Okay, so I snake it in, cup, and I'll use my head. And now I, I use my whole body and I can start pinning his arm down. Now, once my I use my head to kind of uh -oh, keep his arm in, in, I go right on the wrist and the arm. Now, I just I don't come up like this to try to finish, okay? I walk the elbow into his ribs. I just walk, and I motorcycle grip. This is the biggest part here. Watch, I'm going to keep my, I'm not going to motorcycle grip, but I'm going to keep my arms relaxed and see how much, look at how far he could go without even tapping. Now... Once I get this grip and I, I bring his elbow in and I motorcycle grip it, he's tapping right there. Okay, there's too much pressure to bring his elbow to his chest for his shoulder. And he's a flexible guy. Okay, so let's let's do uh, let's just do one more of these. Good control. It's very good for a smaller guy too. Um, but you gotta stay heavy when you go to this transition. So I like to grab, I like to pull. Switch and I keep a, a post with my left my left leg. Right now I keep the head control. So a lot of times, exactly, he might be even framing even more. That's fine. Come up a little bit and I snake it in, grab, and now I'm gonna keep my left elbow in as I pull and push it down. Once I'm here, I grab the wrist, move his elbow down, motorcycle. Grip. So that, that, that's a good way. That's uh, one transition I've been showing my students for uh, getting key locks, especially against bigger opponents. Thanks for watching, guys. Like, comment, and subscribe on my YouTube, and we'll be back next week for some more videos. Oh,